next to you or the persons next to you. Hold on, hold on. Some you may know and some you may not know. But we are into being with those we don't know as well as those that we do. If we just go around with those that we know, we don't get to know those we don't know. That's good philosophy. <laughs> as you join hands, I'd like for you this morning to to be reminded of those who are sick and afflicted, those who are suffering from AIDS and cancer, from heart ailments, those who are suffering from mental illness, those who are suffering from body and physical and psychological and spiritual drought. Hold on now, hold on. And I want you to call out the names of friends, of loved ones, of kinfolks, of people that you'd like for this, this connection of prayer that is to be prayed this morning. Well, reach out to humanity. Call out the names, call out. Thank you. Ron Swishenel will lead us in prayer. Lord, we know that you're with us. And you know the secrets of our hearts. Even though they puzzle the heck out of us, out of us sometimes. We admit our concerns and issues and problems. The names we've lifted up to you. We know that you know about them, but we're hoping that you will give us the courage and the insight and the wisdom to handle all of the concerns. We admit that we're not always grateful and thankful for what we have received. We long for more and more, and then when we get more, we want more. And then when we get more, we're bored with what we have. So Lord, teach us, help us to realize what we have received and to be thankful for the simple gifts we receive that has blessed us each day, for a friendship, for food we eat, for a place to live, for work to go to, for some money, little or much, that we have. Open us up to the mystery and the beauty of our lives give us the wholeness and health that we need so we can be people of joy and people of hope and people of love and your peace can give us the strength and the stability and the calmness that we need our prayers go out to not only those here that we know and don't know but to the larger community and the larger world that suffer from the misfortune and mistakes that have damaged their lives so greatly. Give them the strength they need. Give them the stability they need. Give them the security they need. That they might be free, that they might be whole, that they might be healthy, that they might be fully alive. We thank you, Lord, for life. And we offer these prayers and gratitude. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Right on. Right on. Shalom. Shalom. And salam. Salam.
Brothers and sisters, I want you to know that you're going to hear something this morning. The kids are here. The young people are here. Maybe I should say some of them are here. Because the others will join them at 11 o'clock, I'm sure. Uh-huh. Yeah. You know the directors, Ron and Denny. <laughs> We know that we know God loves all the children, and we want you to know that we love the Lord.
had only known him two years ago when Phyllis went and got him from Cambodia. Yeah. Look at him now. Look, 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 look. Tell you. Hmm. This is the best only signs with rhythm. But he cries with rhythm also. 